Welcome by Style TV. My name is Steven Neider and this is Wim Jaap van Goor. He is the software engineer and he will explain you in this movie how easy it is to make this product with the Style CNC software. I'm going to show you how to program a workpiece on a style control. How easy it is to make a program on a style control. You just seen the drawing of the workpiece that we are going to make. And how are we going to make this drawing? Watch. We start here with file, new. And here we enter the raw measurements of our workpiece. So we enter the outside diameter, inside diameter zero, total length 140, and length outside the jaws 115. I can also select what kind of material it is. Uh, the material is for the, for the cutting data, for the feed rates, for the RPM, etc. So when I enter this in the library, I don't have to enter it during the programming. That makes it a lot easier. Okay? Now, what you see now are the jaws and the workpiece. So the length outside the jaws, outside diameter. And we are going to process this piece of material. So the control automatically goes to process and now I can select what to do. I'm going to start with facing and I select my tool. I enter my cutting data. This comes from the library. This is okay. And now I can enter the facing cycle. Most values are already entered. So the start diameter and diameter. And I only enter, enter the amount of material that has to be removed. Half a millimeter two times and the control will draw one millimeter facing. So we go to the next process. The next process is outside turning. I select my tool. I enter my cutting data. So the cutting for the roughening, the cutting data for the finishing. I press OK. And now I can draw an outside turning contour. So we're ready with for outside turning, the position of the tool, eh, the current position. And we go to draw and we start with move the tool. Now, the drawing starts with a, a thread on M20 and M24. So we start the contour on Z0 and diameter 24. You can see the tool. You can see outside turning and the position of the tool. Uh, I go to uh, draw and I want to move the tool in the material. So I go to move left and I want to move 30 millimeters according to the drawing. Now I want to make a thread outlet, therefore we have a nice option, insert free shape. So I select the shape that belongs to the thread, that's a DIN 67, I press OK. Now I go up, so I select drawing, absolute, and I go to 28. Now we make the angle, so I select left up. Now we enter what we know. We know the angle is 5 degrees and we know that the, it ends at diameter 38. Okay. And now we go to the end of the product, so we go to minus 110. Okay. Almost finished. We need a radius here and here, so I select those lines and with this button I can insert a radius. So I insert a radius of two millimeters. As you can see here is a radius and there. And at the front we need a, a chamfer for the thread. So I select the front and I go to insert angle 45 times two. Okay. Now, this is the outside turning contour, that's ready. Next process, so process, outside threading. I select the threading tool. I enter my cutting data, this comes from the library, this is okay. Now I enter the threading cycle, so it's an isometric thread. And it will start on diameter 24, with a pitch of 3. The depth goes automatic and the pitch angle goes automatic. I only have to enter where to start before the material and where to end, minus 29, and press OK. And here you can see the thread. Last process, process outside 
grooving. I select my grooving tool, I press OK, enter the cutting data for the roughening, for the finishing. And now I can enter my groove cycle. Now the groove starts at minus 92 and diameter 38. It goes to diameter 32, that's the bottom of the groove. And, oh, one back here. We have a radius of one here. And we have a radius of one at the other side, okay? And there is your drawing. Almost ready, we're gonna save the drawing. So we go to File, Save. So next time we have this drawing, we don't have to draw it again. And I call it Shaft, okay? Last thing, before I can start the output, the uh, execute workpiece, I go to Output, Simulation, and here we can see exactly what will be done on the machine during the real execution. You can see the total time, you can play the tools, etc. Bimjaap, thank you very much for this clear demonstration of the style software. If you want to have more information from our style products, visit our website www.stylecncmachines.com and find your distributor. Mm -hmm.